I think the current challenges are still trying to refine the risk stratification. Uh, the current challenges in adjuvant th therapy in general are also trying to find better agents. So one of the, the sobering realities for us, uh, for those of us who treat colon cancer, is that we really have not systemically, from a systemic therapy perspective, improved our options for adjuvant treatment. It's still 5-FU plus or minus oxaliplatin. And uh, that's been the case now for almost 15 years. Uh, and I think, the F, I think we've kind of focused a lot of energy, appropriately so, on strategy. Again, trying to identify who's most likely to benefit. Uh, and as I alluded to earlier, things like CTDNA may, may really help in that space. Uh, but the, the next challenge also is improving the efficacy of adjuvant therapy and what else can we uh, potentially offer our patients to better improve outcomes. Um, uh, CLGB 80702, which was the uh, North American uh, component of the IDEA collaboration, also had a second randomization to look at the utility of celecoxib. Uh, so there, that may help kind of give us an additional opportunity for patients with um, you know, high-risk disease to offer them something else uh, in addition to full-fox chemotherapy. Um, but to me, I think that, that represents both the biggest challenge and I think opportunity uh, for adjuvant treatment of colon cancer in general.